because honestly, what do you, what, what, what was going through your head when you pressed that gas and I was right in front of the car? A Rockford woman says she's lucky to be alive after being struck by a pickup truck driven by alleged vehicle thieves. I honestly thought I was going to die too. Zoe Albasri was at her parents' 20th Street home on August 11th celebrating family birthdays. Not long into the party, they noticed something strange in a nearby parking lot that neighbors have permission to use. Two men were hooking toe straps to her father's van. And they kept claiming they, were, they weren't stealing the car. They had someone um, pay them to tow the car to an auto shop. But nobody in Zoe's family called for a wrecker, so she called police. While waiting for officers, Zoe said she asked the men for proof that they had permission to take the van. That's when she said things went horribly wrong. He looked at me straight in my face and said, I'm going to sit here and wait for the police and pressed his gas and hit me. He hit me and I flipped in the air twice and hit the ground. After bouncing off the pavement and limping away from the scene, Zoe realized she had just escaped with her life. If I didn't hit the ground and roll because of how hard I hit, the ground, I would have been under that car. I would have been dead. I, that would have been the last time I seen my kids, you know what I mean? Zoe's brother, Madi, said he still can't get the image or the sound of his sister being struck by a vehicle out of his mind. If you would have seen it, she flipped over in the air, right? And when she flipped over in the air, she hit, she hit her head and then she hit her body. Madi attempted to chase the truck on foot, but stopped to tend to Zoe, who sustained only minor injuries. The driver and his passenger were later arrested and now face several charges, including aggravated battery and theft. It was, it was just a normal day. It was my brother's birthday, you know, broad daylight. It was maybe like 6.30 p.m. Um, so, yeah, like it felt like my life flashed before my eyes. Reporting in Rockford for your home team, I'm Jim Haggerty.